So I am excited. I'm thankful to John and John for the good work, to the engineer, Ian. Thank you for giving us quality and to Patrick, who has been uh, very instrumental in terms of uh, accounting for all the funds that has been sent to us and uh, to Peter for coming and being here just to celebrate what the Lord is doing together with us and to you, Bishop, uh, for envisioning. We thank God for the achievement. And whatever has remained is about the towers. We need to have a ceiling electricity and bathrooms because we have staffs here and students they need to have a place to take their shower mm -hmm. they need to have a place to take their course we hope that we can complete and we hope the best and through the way of bond we are we will achieve it so the without remaining uh, we need close to 2.5 million, that's about $25,000 to complete this work completely with the ceiling, with the tiles and the electricity and the ablution and all that. And we are trusting God that he who gave us he will also finish the good work that he began. If God gives us money, one of the best things that we are going to achieve is that our student will no longer sleep in a rented house. So we will have our own hostels. So the students who will be living here, they will be living in their own hostel. And uh, so we will be now. We will not. Uh, we will cut the cost of renting every month. So the money which is used for renting, it will be used for either feeding the student and doing other work. This this uh, Bible school is becoming a national school where people will come from very far. And the idea of having those dormitories here, people sleeping, will be very very nice, especially for those who are coming from very far. Apart from uh, apart from cutting the costs. Thanks goes to Segete Church through Pastor Peter. We appreciate the contribution they have made to make this Bible school the way it is. And I'm thrilled to hear that God is bringing people from hundreds of kilometers. And uh, yesterday we moved around this community and we were already tired at the fourth church, which is hardly even over 50 kilometers. So I'm imagining if we are to travel more than 200 or 300 kilometers to see the impact of the students here, that will be another thing. We are hoping that God will grow this into his kingdom impact and uh, many souls will come to the Lord and many churches will be bugged from here. We are going to provide this facility to other trainings to the pastors around this community. We are also hoping to start a computer class where we will bring the community to, especially the young generation who are looking forward to, to the IT knowledge. I want to keep being uh, involved with GOA in one way or the other in the future and we as a church will, will try to continue to support. This is a great work and uh, I'm very happy with the outcome so far.